Welcome to Low Budget Reviews of Streets of Rage Remake. This is Ron Moore along with Venom 22 and Archangel Zero. Um, uh, Streets of Rage. Ugh, I'm back. <laughs> and yeah, this game is freaking awesome. Made by Bomber Games, and yeah, this is uh, the remake of uh, Streets of Rage 1, 2, and 3. Well, that, that's the entire series, actually. Yeah, I remember I was downloading a lot of the betas of this game, then when they finally finished it, I was like, so happy. Played it naked all night. <laughs> when I first saw it, I was like, man, I gotta play this game. I wonder what what new stuff they put in here. Yeah, man. They got, got a lot of new stuff in here. It's it's pretty freaking awesome. And you got the same storyline right here. And we have a pretty cool opening right there. Not as cool as the opening in Streets of Rage 1, but yeah, man, I mean, it's freaking the same, uh, well, it's not the same music, but it's all remixed, and yeah, so Mr. X and this is his hands right there is taking over the city. Yeah, I, I just want to know where to get the soundtrack for this. Um, online. Where online? On the online part of the internet. <laughs> oh, what happened to the music? Yeah, what I like about this is like they like redid the intro and like like I say, you got the remix tracks and you got like the big hands in the air and uh, you wave them like you just don't care. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if those hands can uh, reach out and touch you. I hope not. I hope so. <laughs> Immigration. That's racist. Run, Forrest, run. <laughs> oh. And that was kind of funny. I was looking at Max running right there, looked like a, uh, like the Hulk without the green skin. Uh, yeah, really. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna do uh, two players here. I'm Axel and Venom gonna be Adam. Yeah, it's kinda cool how they put Adam on here, like he's only been on one game. Yeah, really, he wasn't part three, but just that he wasn't playable on there, though. Yeah, I think uh, it's pretty cool that they have the roster from part one, two, and three. That's awesome. Yeah, really, and now oh, they got the Street Race 3 cutscenes right here. Who's that police officer? Uh, that's Axel's brother. Remember on the first game when you called the Popo? Yeah. I wonder if they still have that. Yeah. Yep, they do. Not just uh patrol but uh aerial patrol assault too. Yeah, so you got pretty much a mixture of all three games. You got like the cops helping you, you got your special moves that they introduced in part two, then they got like the runs and the rolls on part from part three. So that makes actually Max pretty good because he can actually run now. Instead of being a slow idiot. Yeah, really, because he sucked in part two. Oh, cool! Look at these maps. You can like pick from all of them. Yeah, you pick different routes, uh, routes, routes, route it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you can tell already it's remix. Yeah, and wait a minute, Venom, your initials are CPU. Yeah, it stands for uh, Carlos Perez Ultimo. <laughs> Oh yeah, the Road Warriors are back in here now. So, so we're opening with Street Race 3. Ah, my least favorite in the series, but oh well. The remake makes it better. I wonder if you get to play some motorcycle guys. <laughs> That'd be cool. It's good to see Adam playable again. You mean Adam West? <laughs> yeah. No, Adam East. I want these bikers to have them girls' names on here like they did in part two. On that cyclone. There was some called Gale and Blow, I forgot. Well Gale's like, you know, Cyclone's like a wind type thing and Gale like, you know, Gale winds and it's an air theme. Yeah, but <laughs> I don't know, Gale and Gust and Tempest. Sounds like a woman wrestler's name or something. Oh, watch out. Oh, that blew up in your face. Where names like uh, Banshee and uh, 
screaming. <laughs> Galaxy is back. It's one of the few tracks I actually liked in Shooter Race 3. The tracks part 3 weren't as good as the first two. So that part's stupid though. Self destruct in 5 seconds. Shut up. There's a lot more enemies on this one. Yeah, this is on normal too. Yeah, I think uh, this is actually harder than the original games, which I like because the original games are fun, but they're kind of easy, even on hard. I don't know. Street Race Two was hard on hard, <laughs> and Street Race Three was hard on normal, and you couldn't even see the enemy to beat on hard. That was stupid. Like, thanks, Konami or Sega. Excuse me. Yeah, I could only watch the ending on YouTube because it was too hard to beat. You know, I had to use Game Genie. Did you never could find one? Yeah, I got the Game Genie codes of Infinite Lives. Remember, I used to tear out the cheat codes when the uh, when the the old uh, Game Pro magazines were at the and the grocery stores. I used to tear out all the cheat codes. And uh, one time, one of the uh, store clerks found me tearing out the codes. She's like, "What are you doing?" I'm like, "Uh, just uh, I just took I just took off running." <laughs> <laughs> he says, "We should reach too." And you threw a knife at his knee. <laughs> <laughs> I um, just killed uh, Jason Voorhees or Rick from Splatterhouse. Oh yeah, and the store clerk told me, she's like, I hope you're not tearing out anything with magazine because I can't sell them without those codes. <laughs> and you, uh, you just throw the magazine at her and run. <laughs> I love the magazine and I just took off running. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh man, not the stupid dance club, man, come on. At least the music sounds better on here than part three. We should have them like uh, breakdancing now and uh, the girls like uh, backing it up and everything. Yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> Street of Rage remake. <laughs> Thank you, Unknown. Um, yeah, someone I think in the YouTube comments of, uh, for Street of Rage 1 said the boss battle music sounds like people are going to start breakdancing in the background while people fight in the foreground. <laughs> that would be awesome. I wonder how come nobody's done that. Probably have you haven't seen it yet. That's how the clubs were in the 80s. Because everybody was breakdancing, but they were all part of the gang, so there'll always be a fight in the foreground and people breakdancing in the background. Yeah, Angel beat one of the dancers. Uh, 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 turtle spin. Uh, at least uh, on here, it's not much of a seizure fest because in part three, when you're in the cl dance club, the, the lights flicker and like you might have makes somebody have a seizure. That was annoying. That's yeah, one of the things they took out. Pretty much, they just tried to polish all the games into one. Cause you know, well, you know, just you know, all of them, all these games are pretty good in their own right. So they like added all of them together and took out all the negatives, while still putting some crappy stuff in there once in a while. Like the bike scene. I thought the bike scene was pretty cool, but I don't even remember the bike scene in any other Street of Rage games. There wasn't. They added that on there for this. That's pretty cool. Um. Yeah, and on here, that the game looks definitely looks polished, and you can pick the different character models too. Like if you want Axel from Part One, or Axel from Part Two or Three, and right here I got Axel from Part Three. So basically, what they did was fix all the lazy developer stuff into what the game should have been. Yeah, and I think they got lazy or rushed Part Three, if I'm not mistaken. It feels like it is rushed, and they didn't fix the AI because the AI is kind of hard on there. So they probably say, you know what? Just leave it. It's gonna make millions. Yeah, <laughs> but it got lukewarm reception when it came out. It definitely was not as good as part two. I like the graphics on it. To me, it looked, the graphics look more polished. The gameplay to me felt better, but it was just too hard. Like it, it was so hard where I couldn't enjoy it. Yeah, really, me too. And remember in our low budget review of Street Race Three, we didn't get to see the ending because we got to the end. We got to stage seven on normal and it said the end you had to be on hard to see the ending and forget that oh what he's in here <laughs> who is that <laughs> that's ash from uh the japanese version of uh, uh bare knuckle 3 the japanese version of shoot your race 3 i am i am uh that is redonkulous <laughs> so yeah you can actually unlock them in a character you know on the american version you unlocked uh, shiva but on japan it was originally this guy whose name is Ash. And there's also a KOF character named Ash who's also very gay, so I don't know if maybe that name is just gay or something. 
They took him out the American version because he was, you know, stereotyp stereotypical homosexual, right? Uh, that's not a stereotype. You see guys like that in the thousands. They're real. Yeah, but I think that's why they took him out the American version. Like, no, that's, eh, we better take that out. Hello, it's freaking hot out here. <laughs> hot stuff coming through. Ah! His real name is Ashcrack. <laughs> Ah, do you hear that when you beat him he screams like a girl? <laughs> my name is Ashley. <laughs> Rick Ashley? Um, my name is Ashley and I came with my mom. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, here's the uh, the bosses from uh, level 1 of Streets of Race 3. I don't like this boss down music. But oh well. You would like this song if you had robot ears. Okay, and... Oh uh, yeah, so you find the uh, Mona and Lisa, I think. Or oh, there was there was the names of part three. Oh, on here it's Onihime uh, and Yasha. What? Yeah, it's Onihime and Yasha. Like, no, I think that might be the original Japanese names. I don't know. I'm stupid. <laughs> yeah, and um, yeah, I would hate to fight those chicks in real life because they're uh, they're built like dudes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I like the polished floor. Kind of like Rogue from X Men in a way. Oh, yeah, they do. I never thought about that. <laughs> and this game really is polished. Look at the floor. I wonder if uh, these girls can absorb your powers. Yeah, they probably can. Once they kiss you and they like hurt you and they kiss you, just like Rogue did. I think they do. <laughs> the kiss of death. Man, yeah, these girls are still hard. They're hard on here, too. Oh. I think there's a way you can land when they throw you, but I forgot again because I'm so stupid. <laughs> these got pushed back, like in Street Fighter. You push back when they throw you and you land. I'm not sure. Can you uh, block on this game? Uh, I don't know. No, you can't block. Blocking is for sissies and for the French. Oh man, the French version of this? I wonder if they wear their French suits. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Do they eat French fries? Yeah. <laughs> man, oh, these girls are annoying. They keep backflipping just like the the twin, the twin females in uh, Street Fighter One. Pretty cool bar. I wish we had one like that here in Wago. We do. Is that an aquarium in the background? Yep. Do they have that in the last one? Uh, we mean part three? Yeah, they do. All right, finally. Finally, you beat the women. Justice was served by beating women, <laughs> <laughs> including Ash. Yeah. <laughs> I found this on one of them. It's an address on the other side of town. <laughs> Let's check it out. We can use those bikes outside, since Those punks won't be needing them anymore. That's how they really talk. Have you seen the movie? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, cool. Now we're going to show Renegade how this stage is, should be done. Even though the part that part of Renegade wasn't that bad. Um... So yeah, on here they added something new to the Street to Rage series. Because um, this is not in any of the Street to Rage games. You can actually do a stage on the motorcycles. That's cool. That is so beast. Yeah, it is. I guess I'm the only one didn't like this. I didn't really think this was necessary. But I think it's something different. So. I mean, you got like that Mexican throwing barrels at you. And, I don't know. Yeah, I think you want to add something a little different on here. <laughs> and I like the, I, I like the music. I like the music in the stage too. <laughs> As Eric and Bumble right in the mic. <laughs> Eric's like, nah, man, I, nah, you be in the front. <laughs> uh, this is the unknown. You wanna throw knives at us now? Oh, watch out, man. He just mad because he's not in this review. <laughs> he has a popo in the truck. He got, he got skinny or something. Yeah. <laughs> That's 
too funny. They showed the piggybacking of the motorcycle. Yeah. <laughs> the Streets of Rage double dash. <laughs> oh, what? Man, die. Storm? That's the X-Men name. No one in this game, no one in the makers of this game is getting sued. <laughs> A Road Rash remake? No. <laughs> I wonder who's the boss on this level. I forgot. Oh, there he is. <laughs> oh, look out. Oh, oh. I mean, the grenades, they really amped up the grenades on here. I like how they really uh, amped up the little details of the game. It's pretty cool. Uh, did they rip off the stage or did they just like make it? Yeah, they just made the stage. So this right here, this is from part two right here. Uh, wait a minute, welcome to uh, Low Budget Reviews with Turtle t Turtles in Time. <laughs> Even though we already did that one. Um. Yeah, I like this track. Sounds cool. Part two, right? Yeah, spin on the bridge. It said on the bottom, pay attention. Uh -uh. I like this track. From part two, right? I didn't finish making the bridge yet. Uh, <laughs> this is Street Rage, the abridged version. Ha ha ha! Can you fall off the bridge? Uh, no, you can't. Not like you can on part one where you're in that one stage and you can fall in the pits. I'm sure did uh, amp up the track on this one. Yeah, they did. Ah, trucker! <laughs> Who's that? He must be new. This truck makes me want to dance till it hurts. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think trucker was in part three. I'm not sure though. Cause I'm stupid. I don't remember, but I don't know. He may be. You mean the mother trucker? Yeah. <laughs> He's actually tougher than he looks. <laughs> it's uh, Hacksaw Jim Duggan's brother. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. What? Oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. Double Dragon 3, double team moves on here. You can do that in other Street Rage, could you? Uh, I think only part 3? Maybe? You don't have no guys named uh, the Bushwhackers? <laughs> no. <laughs> so is this Adam from part one or two? Uh, it's Adam. Um, no, it's just Adam. They just kind of redid his move set. You know, some of those moves he didn't never. All he had in part one was like just basic moves. Cops, so they had to do, redo his moves. I can then include part two, Adam. Because he wasn't in there, you idiot. <laughs> How stupid are you? Alright, and now we're fighting Jet. He's not really that hard. He is a little bit tougher on here, though. Uh, or or Andy Bogard, rather. Oh, there's two of them, I think. There, yeah, there's two of them. Of course, because there's two players. So the other one's a generic one. That's Tomcat. What's he saying? Random Paul? Grasshopper. <laughs> I'm just hypnotized by the flying. I don't know. I can't stop watching. Yeah. <laughs> this should have been uh, Rocketeer on the Sega Genesis. Uh, it looks just like him, though. Yeah. <laughs> or uh, the long haired Chris Jericho. Yeah. I like the remix of this boss down music right here. Oh. Man, come on, he's a special on him. Ah. There you go. Oh. Burning knuckle. Yeah. Burning knuckle. Ah, there's a double team move wasted. Yeah. 
do uh, double team moves in the other ones? Yeah, I think only part three. Ah, there we go. I think the stages are longer. Yeah, I think they are too. I agree, also as well. Thank you, Robot Venom. They're having a team meeting. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they're having a pre-shift meeting at work. He's like, alright guys, we did it. Let's go to let's go to Disneyland now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wanna ride the rides, let's check it out. <laughs> I want some cotton candy. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. Love the stage. Oh, multiple routes. Which way do I go? <laughs> Guess to go this way. So many choices, my head hurts. Yeah, really. <laughs> decisions, decisions. Oh, I love the stage and the music too. They really did a good job remaking it. What stage is this from? Uh, part two. Ugh. The one with the best techno music ever. Who's that guy sleeping on the bench? The unknown. <laughs> we know too many guys that'll sleep on the bench. Yeah. <laughs> this is a uh, Disneyland if it was ran by ECW. We're saying all these random names of people we know, but people watching might have friends that have that name too, and they might do the same things, like sleeping on benches. Yeah. Because <laughs> at night, like the air is cool, you know. Yeah, they love that movie Bench Warmers. Oh, fail. Anyway, here's Rue and Vice City. Grand Theft Auto fan, I guess. I don't know. That's Rue and his baby. Yeah, and Bruce Almighty, or Bruce. Did he get stuck up there? What, what is that up there? Where? Oh, never mind. That's a piece of the, the cardboard or whatever. <laughs> what? <laughs> Point at the screen so everybody can see what you're talking about. So everybody can see your finger. Oh. That's the future. I don't know, man. It's, this is an acid trip fight. It's like a ECW Doink the Clown. Oh, I got whipped. Whoop. I want to play as the the clown trainer guy. <laughs> now you, 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 uh, you should play as uh, either Axel or the, the character that Venom is using, Daniel. <laughs> wasn't that wasn't that clown from Castlevania? <laughs> <laughs> Stephen King's It. No. <laughs> oh, it's a Sonic Arcade. That was uh, Simon Belmont in this game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the, the arcade on this one looks way better than the other one. They had like Virtual Fighter and, and other stuff. And, um, stupid. <laughs> yeah, it has Sonic in this one. What else do they have? Knuckle Loose. Knuckle Loose. <laughs> And the new character, uh, Philip. <laughs> Philip. <laughs> what? Uh. Just imagine playing an arcade and then like the fight breaks out like this and everybody starts break dancing. That'd be cool. Uh, there were some fights back in the arcade, especially for fighting games. Oh yeah. <laughs> like drunk bikers would get mad and fight each other when they lost. <laughs> the only time I think people would fight is if you put your quarter in. And then people were like shoving you get out of the way and they're like, I'm next. You're like, no, my quarter's in. They're like, I'm next, mother... Yeah, <laughs> and they start fighting and everything. <laughs> no, I've seen a fight when people were getting thrown too much and they got mad and they like start fighting the other guy. <laughs> now you cheaty. You, you can't use a dukin. <laughs> you got a little one. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, you can't do that. You can't do that. <laughs> I mean, those Y signals or whatever they're called, they always get my nerves. Yeah, I love it when they do their uh, Sub-Zero slide. Yeah, really? <laughs> oh, monies. Yeah, I don't need it. What stage is this from? Part 2. I mean, what game is this from? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is from Game 2. Game Genie. <laughs> what game is this, Frogger? Man, Frogger ECW style, but it has nothing to do with a frog. <laughs> oh, I like the fan.
fade, the white fade right there to the next screen. You actually pick different transitions, right? I believe, sir. I believe they did. They did it like that for um, aesthetic reasons. And stuff to make it look like a remake. Yes. <laughs> yes. Alright, they just beat up Bolo Young there. Yeah, really. <laughs> they got everybody in this game. I think they got Cody from Final Fight in this game, right? Somewhere? Uh, I think so. Oh. Uh, that guy's name is Dragon. Yeah, these guys are from part 3, I believe. They're a lot easier on here. This game still ain't as hard as part 3. Not <laughs> ah, the ship. What game is this from? <laughs> part 2. Uh, is this like a pirate ship? Yeah. Is this that uh, Neverland ship from uh, Michael Jackson's uh, uh, studio or whatever? <laughs> Both. Man, it's night time already. <laughs> it's been night time. Uh. <laughs> I have to get. I wake up and get knocked back out again. <laughs> <laughs> That's beast. Oh, they got from part one's back. The one that juggles the fire sticks. That's bad. Look, they put in that uh, T Rex head in there. Yeah. Oh, Beano's back, or Jack. Why are those uh, teeth so yellow? Just hadn't brushed them. Uh. That's what smoking does to you, kids. Stay off drugs. But Solid Snake smokes, and he's a hero. Oh, he's not. He's dead now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, that was Barney's voice. <laughs> <laughs> Uh-oh. Man, was this from part three? I think I remember it. No, part two. Really? Yep. Is this from Contra? Yep. Look at all that weed smoke. <laughs> That's why that monster teeth were all yellow. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you can't even see in there. That must be some. Uh, he must have smoked the whole uh, plantation. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> no, they grow it in there. <laughs> <laughs> I have to remake music of this. It sounds much better on here. Yeah, they did a good job with the remixes. Like even some of the songs I didn't like uh, before, they remixed them. I think they're pretty good. They did a pretty good job. And if I ever meet them in real life, I'm gonna give them a hug. Uh, like 50 Cent. Come, well, come, give me a hug. That's a, that's a <laughs> that's a that's a Sean Paul I think. Ron Paul? Yeah. <laughs> uh oh, that growling noise. I think we know what we're gonna fight next. Ah, uh, there it is, the Contra boss. But Be Behelites? I forgot his name. Uh, yeah, he's, uh, Greek. Greek. <laughs> that creature in the background looks like a Contra head. Yeah, that's what I said, a Contra boss. I don't remember you saying that. <laughs> Yep, Bahi... Bahilits? Yeah. There's no way that belongs in this game. There's just no way. <laughs> They're just imagining that. They're high. Yeah. <laughs> that is a good response. <laughs> really, uh, Axel's kicking at the door. He's not even kicking at nothing. They think he's telling his head. Yeah. <laughs> Donut in the park's like, what are y'all doing in there? He's like, we're being this, um, this alien. Yeah. <laughs> this is really high. They're like really walking through Walmart, just throwing the place. <laughs> the cops are coming here. <laughs> Those are really cops in there. They're beating up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, Dude, I found a turkey on the floor. 
<laughs> oh, now we're fighting, fighting Blanco again. Ugh, he goes, eat it, gives you power. <laughs> I think Zamza is a little harder on here. It's Blanca and Vega's love child. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know Blanca was a girl. Yeah, me either. That was man love, baby. Uh, they, uh, this is Test 2, baby. Test 2, baby. It's an experiment gone wrong, but they still kept it. <laughs> yeah. It was an accident, but they kept it. <laughs> Stupid Sub Zero slide. That'll kill. This is Super Move. Yeah. It'd be kind of cool if somebody makes like a Streets of Rage fighting game, like a 2D fighting game. I mean, they got a lot of cool characters on here. What? <laughs> they already did. No, I mean like a fighting game, like Street Fighter. Oh, like tournament fighting. Oh, I thought you meant like what we're playing now. They should make a Dojin game, and if it works, they can make millions. Yeah, really. I gotta cut through some of this. This battle's taking too long. Uh, so like... That guy is really fast. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Unknown. Like the controls. <laughs> oh. I kinda got the blood on here. It's pretty cool. Can you do the blood code in the beginning? <laughs> yeah, kinda. If you go to options to turn it on or off. So you turned it on, right? Yep. Awesome. Yeah, and all right. So we got past stage three now. Oh, I guess we're going to the baseball stadium next. I gotta hear the re remix music for that. I bet that's gonna be cool. Yeah, this is one of my favorite stages and songs in uh, Street of Rage 2. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Uh, the graphics look a lot better. Yeah, really. It's uh, fun at the Sega Stadium. <laughs> yeah. That sign, it's like boo. I like those lights in the background, like they have like show lights or whatever. Yeah, really, that's cool. Stupid sign back there. Do baseball. It's uh, good English. <laughs> it's English. Yeah, the knife, the knife wounds are more brutal on here. I like the details of the leaves on the ground. I want to play in the leaves. Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you make like a tree and get out of here? <laughs> it's leaves, you idiot. You're stupid. <laughs> Ash has joined us now for commentary. Hey guys, hot stuff coming through with the Street Rage remake. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, don't do drugs. They'll like kill you. <laughs> yeah, uh, I always love using the the metal pipes on here. Yeah, and then you can like pull them together and make like a start working. <laughs> <laughs> like if you're playing Marvel vs. Capcom 3, you should use Hagar. He has a pipe. <laughs> He's on that pipe. <laughs> <laughs> that's what you get for kneeling down, you idiot. Get ready to fight. But with the uh, Hagar, that's not a pipe. That's a, that's a straw. Straw. <laughs> All right, uh, Bolo Young is back. I come there and put him as a lock. What? I think he's cool. Nah, he's too limited. All he needs is a punch and kick. Yeah. <laughs> Ninjo, man. They should have made Gaussi as a playable character. Because of that, because they didn't do that, this game sucks automatically. No. Nah. You just lost 10 fans. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this baseball stage is always cool. They should, like, all play in their baseball gear. <laughs> yeah. Babe Ruth is a secret character. <laughs> Yeah, but all he does is make home runs, so he's like the boss. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if there's any uh, famous uh, Japanese baseball players. 
Um, yeah, uh, Yuzo Kashiro, I think, right? Uh, yeah, he's a developer, I think. <laughs> <laughs> he developed baseball. I don't watch baseball. It's boring. Football for the win. I oh, mean, we just lost uh, 20 fans. <laughs> yeah, uh, what about fool's ball? Yeah, fool's ball. <laughs> you know those uh, those uh, fool's ball uh, where you can like grip the yeah fool's ball table yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, we see ourselves on the big screen. Yeah. I didn't even notice that. <laughs> it's like you're fighting and looking at yourself at the screen at the same time. Yeah, you trying to do that and look you look at the screen while punching, you know, even paying attention to what you're really doing in front of you. It's like your neck arcade. <laughs> oh, they got the donut twins in here. Yeah, Trey and oh <laughs> man, what's hurry up! What was the thing about donuts? Oh man, wanna wake up six in the morning and get some colossus cutty. <laughs> That's the best time to get colossus, they're nice and warm and fluffy. <laughs> Big Ben from a uh, problem child. They're so scrumptious. <laughs> oh, whoa! Did Axel just do a different version of the bare knuckle? I think the Donut Twins got like the air maneuver now. Like they try to belly flop you. That's new, right? Did Axel just do a different version of the bare knuckle? I think so, actually. <laughs> did Axel just do not? <laughs> Too deep. <laughs> okay. Um. All right. Yeah, it starts to get a little crazy right here. I like this track. It sounds space age. Yeah. Freestyle to it. Man, it's like space age playing beats of rage. I'm going in a daze. I'm smoking purple haze. I'm so blazed. It's fighting in the cage. Along with Walker, Texas Ranger, Ranger Gage. You guys are a bunch of gays. Like you back in the days. Man, what the elevator just crashes right now? Oh man, that's like doing those. Uh, I think that's a real elevator from the baseball stadium. <laughs> that's a deep elevator, man. How how many miles deep is it? That's why the name of the song was hmm, "Too Deep." <laughs> how these guys? So these guys are just jumping down from way up there from where we first fell. I mean, when we first descended, just jump down and land without breaking their legs. Because they're cyborgs. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. Yeah, just like in real life, you jump off a tall building, you'll be fine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, finally we stop. I didn't even put too many quarters in the elevator. <laughs> This arena's empty. This sucks. In part two, it's all wild and sold out. Now it's all dark and empty. I think they're the they're there to clean it up. Oh, there they are. Oh, now the ECW crowd is here. Oh, Hogan. Yeah, we're really fight the Ultimate Warrior. Apadidi. What? That that does look like the Ultimate Warrior. Yeah, really. This is crazy, he's Ultimate Warrior 2. Look at that. Ah. He's all uh, juiced up in his, uh, in his uh, karate mask. His <laughs> karate mask. <laughs> he's a man, if he's a man on him, he actually sees the steroids like flowing through his body. Yeah. <laughs> I think he's been eating too many uh, cornflakes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Oh, watch out, man. What are you doing? Sorry, all white people look alike. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there we go. Uh, this looks to me where it doesn't look white, though. Yeah, really? <laughs> oh, just chunky. It's because he's tan. Because he's from Florida. I have some parts unknown, remember? Uh, he's from Jersey Shore. <laughs> Name Adobe Premier? Oh, Abadidi. What kind of name is that? He's got a developer name. Yeah. <laughs> developers, developers, developers. That'd be his move. He keeps on saying that and it'll kill you. <laughs> Alright. 
is finally gone. Stage four, stage four, clear. It's clear, Cuddy. <laughs> got an extra man's. <laughs> yeah. Ah, <laughs> uh, but he got beat by Max. So Max is taking all the credit. He haven't done anything yet. <laughs> yeah, really, man. He always does that. We beat the game. Nobody, nobody wants to use him because he sucks. And then at the end of the game, like in part two, it shows him standing there like he helped out. <laughs> That's like Dolph Lundgren does here. <laughs> who, who does Skate look like? Uh, Skate? <laughs> Looks like Max, uh, I mean, what's the name, uh, Payne? What's the name of that actor? What? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, stage five, the boat. Slow moon. Oh, this yeah, this track's awesome. I mean, uh, Martin Lawrence. He looks like Martin Lawrence. He said Max Payne. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking of his uh, show name, Martin Payne, or something like that. Oh, that's his real name, Martin Payne, but the show was just called Martin. Yeah. Oh, yeah that, 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 that was his name on the show. His real name, yeah, real name is Martin Lawrence. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like how the remix remix this music it made it sound even more epic. I didn't think that was possible. He got heart, or a heart attack. He could actually chunk the dope boys now. Before he couldn't, uh, he couldn't flip them. Yeah, he can't. He just can't flip the. Uh, on part three, you can't flip them. And in part one, they got those even fatter ones, the fat Asian ones that spit fire at you. You can't, you can't flip them either. Oh, man! I took that off a of street fighter. Man, he threw the yoga fire off. <laughs> man. <laughs> Where are they at right now? Stage five, the boat. Oh, so they're like um, in the boat. Yeah. I'm on a boat. I'm on a boat. Everybody, look at. <laughs> All right, now, now don't rock the don't rock the boat. Or the make a rap video on the boat. All right, whatever floats your boat. Biatico? This is new names. Ah, oh, Sagat with hairs back. No, oh, that's Joe from Fiddle Fury. Oh, yeah, that's right. Joe Higashi. Joe Mangashi. <laughs> Raven from ECW? What? You see that they had an energy bar for the crate. That was st kind of stupid, but anyway. What, are you trying to say inanimate objects don't have lives? Like this chair you sit in, it has a life. Like I'm a step right now. <laughs> <laughs> this uh, Ace of Base track. <laughs> <laughs> Going back to 1995 now, where, whatever they came out. <laughs> I saw the sign. <laughs> uh, Kevin, I mean, uh, Kevin Ash. Wayne is back. Do you still have that CD? I heard it on the radio. <laughs> and I started bumping it loud. <laughs> oh, whoa! You're living in danger. <laughs> <laughs> the beast. <laughs> <laughs> Where's that from? Ace of Base. <laughs> One of their songs. I don't know the name of it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I used to like it when I was a kid, but I don't remember the name of it. I used to dance their songs in my underwear in my room. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. And people at school found out about it. I would get beat up every day at University Middle. <laughs> That's why I didn't go to that school. <laughs> like, no, Mom. No, let me for my jerry curls. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I like that it really the background here. No mom, they're gonna make fun of my perm. <laughs> Ain't the background like from one of the intros from one of the other games, I think? Uh I don't remember. I just know this background wasn't in the original 
part two. There's just nothing but water, I think. Ain't the background from one of the. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was where. Uh, that part of the stage is where the jerry curls are made. <laughs> You're still on there. And thus, <clears throat> it was born. Yeah, that was a fantasy. Oh, yes, I like the backup in this game. You also use a car and a helicopter. That's cool. After part one, I think they ever bring back <laughs> the backup, but they never did until a remake. These are the Road Warriors. Yeah. Oh, no, watch out. Who are these guys? Oh, man, the grenades. Oh, <laughs> they have more ECW. And, oh, Venom got game over. Yeah, let me push manually start here and pick Blazzy. <laughs> Blazzy Blue. Yeah. <laughs> I cannot blaze red. Yeah. <laughs> I got the, so you got blaze from uh, Street Rage Three here. Oh what? Fighting Shinobi. That's what they should do next. Uh, Shinobi remake. Oh, that'd be awesome. Yeah. <laughs> the next one they should put like all the characters in here, like Shinobi. Uh, uh, Ninja Gaiden. <laughs> and who? Sonic and, and Tails and the Goombas. Hey, already. Oh, here's the boss. Oh, not him. <laughs> Guy's name is Balloon. <laughs> Balloon! More like Blimp. <laughs> that looks so funny when they try to do the air move. Yeah, really. Yeah, they're like Kirby when they do that. <laughs> Do you see that jump kick they got too? <laughs> it's a kick. <laughs> Bomb go from Ocarina Tom. Oh no, Super Vacation Guy. What's his name? Uh, I don't know who that is. I forgot his name. <laughs> I remember you called him Vacation Guy or something. This bald bull. Yeah, he really let himself go, but he can still fight. He really is on vacation. Yeah. <laughs> What's he doing? Oh, <laughs> back up. Oh, he still can't kill him. That looks like unknown on vacation. Yeah. <laughs> now that's uh. I forgot. His, yeah, John. Yeah, I, for, I forgot his name. <laughs> yeah, he's he's uh he's been on vacation too long. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, he still got them. He still got them hands, though, Cuddy. He so started making our casing. He started whooping everybody. Yeah. <laughs> got that command center. <laughs> they still pretty challenging on here too. I always hated fighting this guy in the original game. So so annoying. Yeah, nice, no, he's pretty hard. <laughs> oh, there you go. All he, all he wanted was a milkshake from downstairs, and they, were, they just started fighting him. <laughs> How can we do his bull charge? I'll bull charge you. <laughs> That's a bunch of bull. That's a cool pick of Blas. I'm not looking at Blom, I'm looking at Zan. Look, look, it's cool. Oh man, look at that. Look how sexy Zan looks. <laughs> yeah, he looks like a beast. Sigma. <laughs> Sigma. Oh cool, look at the intro on this stage. I got this from uh, one of the Sonic games. Yeah. <laughs> I think you run like Blaze, don't you run? You what? You see how she was running? That's how you run. Oh, yeah. So? <laughs> so, uh, this stage, you know? Now, oh, this is in part two. I remember this stage. Yeah, the beach. Uh, music sounds much better on here. Did the sand look like this, or do they look like they retouched that, maybe? Yeah, I think they retouched the sand. They touched it and touched it again. <laughs> I think they put uh, dirt in there. <laughs> yeah, they put some uh, seashells in there this time. You can't really see it, though. Seashells, she sells, she sells. Um, I 
see she shows up to show <laughs> shit. Does she have to shut up? Um. <laughs> I think that guy was a boss. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, that's the best way to do it. Just like Ocarina of Time. Those construction work. <laughs> That guy, he's all buff for no reason. He, he's like his arms stick out all the time for no reason. <laughs> he has a hard time wiping his butt. Yeah. <laughs> he uses one of those back scratchers and puts toilet paper on it. Yeah. Shoot <laughs> <laughs> uh, Rage Remit. Oh. Man, it must be a Thailand. Yeah, really. Oh, back up. Yeah. That's the only way they could defeat him. They fought like four kickboxers. No way. Yeah, really. But that back. Yeah, the backup was, uh, helped him out a lot. Oh, now we're in a, another contra stage. Or <laughs> yeah, the backup was like, okay, these guys are getting their ass kicked. Just, just go in. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> oh, I like how they remake remix this one. Yeah, I didn't like this song in part two. On here, it sounds much better. Now that's what I call music, volume 59. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> oh, what? Oh, yeah, look. Ah, uh, Mr. X. Yeah. I feel like I'm high listening to this track. Hey, <laughs> you can definitely have a, a techno rave with the song. He's got a gun? Yep. Beast. Yeah, really, the Uzi. Yeah. Axel is gangsta. Yeah, really. Uzi, is that what he used in the 50s for the gangster? <laughs> that was a Tommy gun. Stop or my mom will shoot. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Say hello to my little friend. Yeah. <laughs> this is Cameron Park. <laughs> Wait a minute. How oh, this is being filmed in Cameron Park? Yeah, right. <laughs> Street Rage movie is being filmed. The stage is filmed in Cameron Park. <laughs> Dormano, Goba, Go Go Go, Go Go 13. <laughs> Gail, there's that girl's name. Get out of here. Oh, oops, sorry. <laughs> oh, sorry again. <laughs> <laughs> That's messed up having a name like that. It's like the like if the parents have some uh, little boy and like, what's gonna be his name? Which will call him Leslie. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> oh, move, man. What? Are you getting given? Hugging each other in the middle of a <laughs> She needed to share her feelings. The next one, they should have Blaze get pregnant. <laughs> right now, she got kidnapped by Mr. X and kidnapped her child and I don't know. <laughs> no one knows who the dad is. <laughs> Shocking twist in the storyline is Mr. X. <laughs> or Shiva. Yeah. <laughs> She's the father. Yeah. And then you can unlock a uh, Mari Povich has a secret character and he reads the results of the the, the paternity results. <laughs> and they all start punching her. <laughs> oh, now I got Pipe Blanca and uh, three Chris Jerichos. Dang, man. Yeah, wasn't it original only like that Blanca guy and like one jet guy? Yeah, like normal difficulty. Probably on hard or hardest or mania. They probably had six of them, but <laughs> I mean, what was it? Jackless Castle in the background or at Mr. X's Corporation? I think it's um, everybody. <laughs> That's a crazy kite. Man. Go fly a kite. Huh. Souther. And what was the other one's name? Uh, uh, oh, that's Souther and then Axel and Blaze. Oh, wait. Um, Stealth. Oh man. 
I don't know what I'm looking at. There's so much going on. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> It's almost like the street is full of rage. <laughs> Roid rage. Roid rage. <laughs> Man, I hope this guy, guy's not gonna take a long time again. Come on. Yes. You have to push a button to do that, or is it just automatic? Yeah, well, yeah you, you can uh, push. Uh, forgot what button. I haven't heard it used yet in this game. I know the CPU can do it too. That's pretty cool. You mean push play? Yeah. <laughs> Why don't you die? Oh uh oh. What? Are you, are you a cool, cool cutty? What? What'd she say? You should say Hadouken. <laughs> she didn't say it meanly though. She's just like Hadouken. <laughs> she let her estrogen uh, do the talking. <laughs> oh, what? I can do it too. <laughs> oh, yes. How many stages are there? Uh, 50. I think the number of stages there are is when you beat them and you find out how many stages they are. Yeah, really. <laughs> Man, he looks awesome. Yeah, really. <laughs> they should uh, make him as a pet. Yeah. <laughs> Back in the industry. Oh, look, this stage is even more epic looking. Oh, this is the Terminator stage. Is that all that lava? Yeah, this is uh, where they filmed uh, the ending of Terminator 2. <laughs> That's really hot doo doo. <laughs> this music, uh, it was alright in part two. It sounds, uh, much better on here. You see, uh, Ninja Turtles come out of there? Yeah, right. Nah, I, like how, I like how they redid the background though, the lava there. It looks pretty cool. Yeah, really. I think I do see an exoskeleton of uh, Evil T1000 somewhere back there. That would be awesome, actually. Yeah, oh, there it is. Oh, no, wait. There it is over there. <laughs> Ain't that like the skeleton of Mr. X, the robotic one? Yeah, it is. Yeah, I think so. I think so also as well, too. I know, though. And, um... Uh, oh, 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 Dante's Inferno, that's his name. Oh, Dante. Dante from Devil May Cry got fat. My name is Dante. I thought it was Dante. <laughs> Dante? Yeah, an angel may laugh. What was it called? Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, what? Man, <laughs> I can't make up my mind what I wanted to do. <laughs> I look how they remix. Look, or listen how they remix this music right here. Hey, look at this music right here. Yeah, look at it. And I want you to hear that on the screen. You, you, you hear all that? You hear all, all that uh, guys fighting? <laughs> hey, check out, like, look at this pizza. Hear, hear how good it smells. <laughs> yeah. Oh, look out. Oh, ECW. Uh, the guy's name was Dew. That's why he got blown up. It's like, hear how these uh, dead anchovies uh, smell. So someone could walk up. So someone can walk up to that character dude and say, What it do, dude? Mountain Dew do. <laughs> Mountain Dew do. Tornado. Oh, Carrie Von Eric's on here? I think it would actually make more money if it was Mountain Dew do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this should be the new drink, Mud Butt. What? <laughs> <The> mud Butt. <laughs> No, if ands or buts, this is the ultimate drink. Mud bud. <laughs> For those who do not know what mud bud is, it is diarrhea. Diarrhea. <laughs> 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 
Should, th these ninjas should have been a, a playable character. Jay, the ninja's name is Jay. Ooh, how can we maybe a playable character in this game? Ooh. They gotta put Ash first. <laughs> uh, you're a playable character. Your face is playable. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Alright, Jay's dead. I'm gonna fight Star Soldier next. No. <laughs> Boo-ho? What's his name? Boo-ho? Boo. Throw ho? Oh, <laughs> It's like Buddha, but they forgot to put the A. It's Bud. <laughs> yeah. I think it's a uh, bidet. Bidet. <laughs> <laughs> Daryl da 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 Hannah and. He's a French ninja. <laughs> French ninja? <laughs> what? Oh, man. He's an, uh, he's an Arabian. Boxer, I don't know. <laughs> what are you doing? Whispering? Alright, this is scripted. What move do we do next? Uh, Irish whip. Off the ropes. Into the ropes. I guess the ropes. Everyone talks too much. Yeah, really? <laughs> She's there to whip them back into action. Yeah. Wait a minute. Is her name. She... See if they show it in a minute again. Eloy or LD? Uh, I think she's a tranny. <laughs> hey, look at them there, robots from the Robocop movie. Yeah. <laughs> I thought Robocop made an appearance in WCW. Yeah, um. So, I mean, it's the same robots in part three. Oh, what is he, the suicide bombers now? I don't know what those are. <laughs> oh, they are. Oh. Were those even in the other games? I don't even remember those. They weren't, I think they just put them on here. But these robots right here are part three. Were those from Commando? Yeah. Anyway, um... <laughs> oh, yes. This stage is gonna make me start breakdancing in a minute. Uh, I wanna see. <laughs> is this uh, platform about to start moving? Yeah. I don't know which is better, the original uh, track or the remix track. They both make you want to start breakdancing. Uh, yeah, I still want to see that. Yeah. <laughs> if Skate was on here to start breakdancing, he's the only one that can breakdance in this game. <laughs> Isn't it that one stage from the Turtles with the big balls come down, and then like the balls hit you, and then like there's dogs with bees in their mouth, and they walk to shoot bees at you, and the balls come down? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And then the dogs eat the big turkeys, and then they get the uh, the BGs. <laughs> anyway, uh, the uh, Andy Bogar twins are back. Oh, Comet and Ajax. Oh wait, what's the other one's name? Griffith. Griffiths. I like Ducious. Ducious. Fail. I think it's uh, Griffiths Maximus Aurelius Decimus Hexadecimal. <laughs> Street of Rage remake. <laughs> Why'd they make a remake of Street of Rage remake? They should do another remake. <laughs> yeah, a remake of a remake. Ooh, mosquito! Oh, mosquito! Yeah, I thought it said mosquito too. Like the movie? Right, uh, giant mosquitoes. <laughs> oh, you mean the fly? Yeah, and oh, come on, mosquito die! Finally, moving up. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Su Suicho and Sar or Suryu, Reikin, M Mustard, what? Ah, too fast. All those guys work for a temp agency? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> or Jack of, Jack of All Trades. That was their job description. Okay, you're going to go into this elevator and try to kill these guys. There's no insurance, no minimum wage, and we don't cover any of the injuries at the job. Yeah, Mr. X really takes care of his boys. <laughs> that guy's name is Ho -Oh. Ho oh. Oh 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 oh. Where's Sword at? Oh oh, that's the weapon you have. Tempest, Thrush, Blush, more like it. Fail. How about Blush? <laughs> That'd be Ash's name. <laughs> Blush. Yeah, this is a uh, foreign uh, exchange students. Yeah. <laughs> Ibis Sparrow. 
it's getting crazy here. There's no way to treat your employees. Yeah, Rudy. Oh, look out. Oh. Oh, Raptor. That's a cool name. Where's Riptor at? He's not even trying to use... He's not even uh, supposed to use weapons. Yeah, they're cheating. Man, look at that. Oh, at least the enemies, though, can get blown up, too. That's cool. This game uh, shows mercy to nobody. Say, look at me, Mom. Look at me. Ooh. Oh. Look at that. Oh, what are you doing? Oh, I guess I'll get blown up. <laughs> uh, there's Gale and Hale, and Hale. Come on. Yes. Back up. Oh, 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 oh. Break it down. Ah, uh, Sawyer. I guess he's about to soil his pants. Oh, fail. Is that fat guy's name? Henry? Henry? They ran out of ideas right here. Titan. Let's call them the Doughboy Twins. A Doughboy Twins? A Dobo Twins? I think they misspelled angry. They forgot to put the G there. Yeah. I guess Capcom's Big Man 3 staff was in charge of spelling in this game. <laughs> this is so beast. Yeah. I think the music's so fast, like, my brain can keep up with the lyrics. Yeah, really. <laughs> Yeah. Street Rage remake. Makes you wanna play the piano really fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Try playing this on piano, that'd be cool. I'm gonna play this song when I take a shower. Be like extreme showering time. <laughs> yeah. You scrub really hard in one place. Oh <laughs> man. <laughs> Use a uh, shampoo for the rest of your body instead of your hair. <laughs> what? Anyway, all right. Now we fight the robots from uh, part. Oh, it's three of them. Molecule. Oh, wait a second. There's, there's four of them. What? Somebody put together Robocop wrong. <laughs> yeah. Uranium molecule particle. It's like a stage that was designed by Angel. They're like, what should we put it in the stage? Like robots. How many? A butler. <laughs> yeah, really. Oh, this is gonna be crazy. Four of these guys. My motto is, you can never have enough robots. Yeah, this ain't Street Race 3, come on. Who made these robots? I guess Dr. Wally, I don't know. <laughs> one of them should be named Samus. Yeah, Samus. Isotope is one of them. Uh, particle and... Uh, uh, Centigram, I don't know. <laughs> Grimlock. Hey, <laughs> Grimlock. Matlock and all them. <laughs> hey, Matlock. <laughs> Murder, she wrote. <laughs> yeah. Uh, Perry Mason. <laughs> uh, what was that one show? MacGyver. <laughs> yeah, Ma yeah, MacGyver. <laughs> yeah. yeah dun, 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 dun. MacGyver. Fighting robots. Oh, back up, yes. MacGyver put together these robots with a rubber band tape and some super glue. <laughs> yeah, and some plastic silverware. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, <laughs> bubble, yeah, bubble gum. <laughs> so they're shooting now, isn't that lasers like a honey dense bubble gum? Yeah, ready. <laughs> Trident or whatever lasts forever. We got bubble wrap all over them. Yeah. <laughs> And we still haven't killed one yet. Oh, Venom got game over again. Oh, uh, finally we killed one. Man, <laughs> these robots don't play around. I think they have um, like real like kangaroo legs, but they put armor on them. Yeah, really. They killed Roo and took his legs. Oh, we're down to one now. You got some really sexy legs, though. Okay. <laughs> Time he jumps, I'm like, dang. <laughs> look, look, look at those thunder thighs. <sighs> oh, oh, finally clear. Look at those hooves. Hooves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Arg! What a powerful explosion, dude! It must have a self-destruct mechanism. Huh.
Are they doing like a Power Ranger pose there or something? <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> There's a Amy, the Pink Ranger, Amy Joe Johnson. Uh, all right, finally the last stage, and Adam is back somehow. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, why is he there? Um, yeah. Everybody ignore that. Just pretend it's Blaze. <laughs> and, oh man, now these two two of the robots are back. Like, we just got fought you guys. Like, give us, give us time to breathe, oxygen. Come on. It's because the developers don't breathe. Yeah, especially that one guy. Developers, 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 yes! Yeah, especially. But, oh, he seed up. He seed up. Damn, they lost brain cells. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, Ball Bull Junior. And another robot, Mercury. Man, how the how the vacation guy get in there? He's on vacation. I don't know. <laughs> he he signed up to the agency. Yeah, really, the temp agency. <laughs> they liked him. They decided to keep him full time. <laughs> oh. Actually, he was supposed to be at work, but uh, he was uh, he was uh, milking the hours. Yeah. <laughs> oh, they got mad because he got, he got overtime, <laughs> so they cut back his hours. <laughs> Come on, why is this guy so hard? He kind of looks like my old boss if he only had a beard. Yeah. <laughs> Who? No. Uh -uh. Looks like me in a couple years. <laughs> yeah. Pringles got let himself go. Who is the flamethrower guy? No, this guy. Flamethrower guy? Yeah, that flamer. Uh, yeah. Yeah, music. Uh, touch it up on here. Still sounds just about the same, but still pretty awesome. The song makes me want to touch myself. Well, it's not that awesome, but anyway. <laughs> Think of that song. When I think about you, I just. Think about you. All right, now going through the waiting room and into the elevator. Watch out! Oh, they're just going there to see a sick relative. <laughs> I don't know why, but for some reason, Axel looks like Axel Foley from Beverly Hills Cop. Axel? What do you mean, Adam? Yeah, Adam. That one, that one guy. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, actually, looks like Cody from Final Rage or whatever it's called, Final Fight. Yeah. Final Fantasy Fight. Oh. Actually, looks like one of those guys you see in the gymnastics video, the tight pants and the sneakers, working out. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> All right, this now this is another version of Kevin Ash. This is Vulture. Oh. Ooh, Dr. Dr. Death German Suplex. Oh, what? We can Chuck Norris roundhouse kicks. Oh. Yeah, there's a secret code where you can play as Chuck Norris on here. Yeah, we should try it. <laughs> Get a lot of comments. You lie. I looked online. You lied. Dude. Uh, no, I didn't. It's a hack. Hit the down of the hack. <laughs> oh, there we go. This is a uh, like elevator action, but for the Sega Genesis. No. Really, they're just waiting in the elevator, and this is all in their head. Yeah, really. <laughs> the elevator music's hypnotic. Yeah, it is. Now we're doing a boss rush here. We beat Kevin Nash, and we're fighting Blanca again. They're just hallucinating this. <laughs> they're just standing there, really just drooling. Yeah, really. <laughs> Looking at some girls' boobs. <laughs> Zora? Well, she's breastfeeding. Oh. But it's really a fat guy. <laughs> yeah. Makes me want to go to an elevator now. Yeah. <laughs> With a fat guy? No, the fat guy is me. <laughs> Alright, now it's Phoenix. Oh. Ultimate Warrior's back. This time he's Z Kusano. 
B Krauser? What? <laughs> See, this is one thing that Future Rage did at the final fight that you do. Like they would put like boss characters, regular enemies later on. It was annoying. Yeah, it really makes them look less tough because now they become generic. Well, yeah, because they're, they're, they're only getting paid minimum wage now because they lost. Yeah, really. The only generic fighter I can see that made it into the big leagues was uh, Hugo became, from Final Fighting, became actual uh, awesome fighter and, and street fighter. <laughs> Yeah. Well, Relento and Saddam are Street Fighter now, too, and so is Poison. So it's not just Hugo. It's them, too. Cody and Guy. <laughs> right. Oh, game over again. Oh. Uh, now, now there's Blaze. Oh, she's been there the whole time. Um, She just had her baby. <laughs> now she's back. <laughs> Oh, now she's dead. <laughs> oh no, he's dead. Man, <laughs> Roy Rage. <laughs> oh, watch out. Ah, right, there we go. Uh oh, here we go. I love that new Chivo. He's so cool. Look at him. Yeah, but Mr. X is ECW. When I grew up on him, be like Shiva. <laughs> when you grow up, you're older than him. And then I want to be like Mr. X. <laughs> Uh-oh. Look at Mr. X. This time he's smoking a cigar. He's even more bad. That's a Cuban cigar. Yeah, Cubans. You don't get Cubans that easily. It's a blunt. <laughs> <laughs> he smoke wherever he wants. He's Mr. X. Ah, oh, man, here we go. Now the ultimate battle with Shiva for Mortal Kombat. This is the best ninja ever. Yeah, he's freaking awesome. He should be in a movie. Should have named him Show Enough. <laughs> yeah. Show Enough. You can't throw this guy because things don't always land on his feet. He's like Sub Zero without the mask. Yeah. Like from part three? It's from all the parts. <laughs> from parts unknown. I hear the music like my brain is tingling. Yeah, <laughs> that's how intense this battle is. That's not the music, that's just the LSD. Like <laughs> <laughs> oh, the ECWD? Nah, oh, Phil. Yeah. <laughs> well, Mr. actually just kick them when they get too close to him. It would be funny if he did, just like push him his foot. Like, get back out there and fight. It's like in school, whenever you want to fight, people would go gather around you and push you. <laughs> nah, that's what I would do if I was Mr. X. <laughs> I bet you he was a bully in school. Whenever you didn't give him lunch money, you just put a hit out on him. <laughs> he's always rich. Yeah, really. Look at he laughs. Who laughs at people like that? That's evil. Well, laughter is fun and good and happy times. Now it's on. I got skate this time. As soon as you say that, you got punched in the face. <laughs> Is it happy now? Man, we still finally got him to one last bar. Dang, you still fighting Shiva. Yeah, they made it look stupid in part three. They had him as the first boss character. Man, come on. Well, that was originally Ash in that part. In the American version, they put Shiva. How could they make somebody different? Because America's stupid? <laughs> oh, finally. Finally. Dang, there's Constipate right there. He's really mad. He's like a goat. Yeah, really. Oh, he, man, Mr. X is harder on here. His, his bullets are harder to dodge. I didn't know he could walk. Who needs martial arts when you have guns? Yeah, really. <laughs> He's a big dude, too. Oh, look out. He uh, juices up with steroids for no reason. <laughs> yeah, really. I think this fight would have been more epic if he didn't live his chair. Like, his chair just had wheels on it. And he shot you while he was riding around it. He'll fly around, He'll fly around this chair at you like Dr. Claw. <laughs> 
I mean, we, we can use backup right here. The helicopter can shoot through those windows. Come on. Mr. X is just the... Uh, he's from the Expendables. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he's in Expendable 3. He's gonna be. <laughs> they should have him in there. That's a bad guy. Oh, what? Man, I was behind him. How does his bullets hit me? It was a bullet show. <laughs> yeah, that's how epic his gun is. Even the bullet shells can do damage. He even pistol with blaze. Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. He was like, get back down now. <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, man. He can do more than shoot. He can pistol with too. This is epic boss down music for this right here. Mr. X is from Louisiana. He talks like he's from the bayou. <laughs> Get that Gairo! Get that Gairo! <laughs> oh! Oh, he's actually fighting! Yeah, I think they added that. I don't remember him doing that in the old game. Yeah, everybody, all we do is hit you with his gun and shoot you. He's actually punching and kicking in this one. See, he's more evil. I mean, what kind of boss shoots their own henchmen to get to you? Oh, look at that. Watch out for the shells. Oh, man, that was epic. Ah, Andy Bogard, uh, Terry Bogard posed. Was that the end of the game? Yep. No way. Yep. It's only eight stages, but... Man, they're long. Yeah, really. It feels like Street Trace 3. <laughs> oh man. I had to put this music in there. Man. Does that say it's Streets of Rage... Romance? <laughs> That's what it sounds like with this music. Streets of Rage... Romance Staff. <laughs> They all made babies during this game. Oh man. <laughs> Hear the music. <laughs> yeah, really. Man, Ash, man, Ash composed compose his music. <laughs> yeah. You notice it's nothing but Latinos that made this game, that's why it's so awesome. Except for that one guy. He was just a janitor. <laughs> yeah, from uh, Survival Arts. <laughs> yeah. Sonic, what? Chris, Final Crash. <laughs> Those are hacker names. <laughs> yeah. Whose artworks? Oh, wait. Yeah, Arth, Ki Kiwi. Yeah, it's their online name, then their real name after their online name. So, like, my name would be the Pooper, then you see my name. <laughs> BGM1401. Oh, he lost his gun. Now he's powerless. That's so all you need to do is kill him. Just, like, take the gun away from his hands. He would have died. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> Look around at bullets. What would he do then? Um, that gun doesn't run out of bullets. He doesn't even have a gun clip. He just keeps shooting. Yeah. Sega and Ancient. Yo Yujo Koshiro. Composed original music. He's awesome. And us for playing the game. Thank you, Sega. Yep. We're taking this game down. No. You mean screw you, Sega, for taking their game down. <laughs> Look at that. Took seven years to make. I mean, eight years. Yeah. Um. It's how long the game lived. It died in, tw in 2011. <laughs> yeah, really. Oh, man. Yeah, so this right here is where you, uh, it tells you all the points you accumulated during the during the game and you can save this and then go to the store and buy all, all sorts of things later on and uh, screens of rage <laughs> that's when you beat the bosses and stuff it like saves it I think I mean like the actual footage of you doing that yeah like the final hit when you kill the boss that's what it uh, records I know that I thought it was just showing all the stages you've been through <laughs> Maybe it is, I don't know. I did some research on that. No, it looks like the ending right there just now, so it might be it, yeah. Uh, I got number six, I got number eight. I'm better than you. No. Dang, someone got a million points on Mania? Man, that's a hack. Come on. Yeah, it's, that was on Mania. I mean, it was already hard on normal. I don't even want to play it on Mania. Yeah, really. I think you have to be from Romania to play it on Mania. <laughs> or you have to beat WrestleMania. Ah, oh, fail. Anyway, um, 
Yeah, man, Streets of Rage Remake. Man, this game is freaking ECW. I mean, I heard about this game, didn't really get to play it till recently, and I'm I'm addicted to this game right now. This is the game I'm playing right now, and I mean, you can unlock so many hidden characters, and so many cheats, and so many extras, and there's different things to do in this game. There's multiple endings, multiple uh, uh, routes you can take in the game. You can like relive uh, Streets of Rage one, two, three, and I mean, it's just it's just epic. This game, there's so much to do in this game. I mean. It's just freaking awesome, and if you love Streets of Rage, you'll be addicted to it <laughs> real quick. And yeah, uh, I mean, this game is just freaking ECW. Um, I have to give it a 9.5 out of 10. Yeah, um, like like I said, um, I've downloaded pretty. I played a lot of the betas of this game before they got to the final version, and it was pretty cool to see how much the game they had moved along into making it. Really shows how the People that worked on this fan project really just love the Street of Rage series. You can see, you can you can feel the love in the game. It's just uh, so much love. Um, no, but uh, I mean they I mean they t <laughs> they touched up the graphics. I mean the the remix music. You know it's pretty awesome. Uh, how you can pick the routes. You know you got to go through different stages of the game and some stages that they even made like with the with the uh, bike stage and stuff. And there's some other stages too. Like the rooftop stage and stuff, um, um, you know, and also you know having Axel in there, and also having the elements from Part Three where you can run and roll, which actually makes Max pretty good, and some of the other creatures a little bit better too. It's just uh, overall a good game. Just kind of mad that Sega took their made them take down their their game from their website, so you got to get it through other means. Still easy, but you know. So uh, yeah, um, I give this game a um, nine point five out of uh, negative ten. Angel? Yeah, um, this is a fanboy's dream come true right here because it combines part one, two, and three together. You never know which stages or what characters or even what they're going to add new to this game. So by playing it the first time, you're going to be like, man, this is like everything I wanted to see in a new in a new Streets of Rage remake. So, you know, if you haven't played it or you haven't played in a while, I kind of wish it was downloadable, you know, maybe on, you know, consoles just so I can have it and play co-op or play online so I give it a 9 out of 10 because I think they could have added more I know that's that's being greedy but greedy. <laughs> I want to see more but uh, I think they should have the real developers make it next time so I give it a perfect 10 if it comes out like for consoles downloadable whatever so uh, yeah I agree with everybody you know Ron and uh, Venom that uh, yes, I would give it a 9.5 but I give it a 9 just because I want to see the developers do it Yep, and there you go, our review of Street of Rage Remake. It really is ECW. So we're out of here. I'm Ron Moore. Archangel Zero. Venom 22. <laughs> yep, let's take care. Uh, 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 plop. Street of Rage. Street of Rage. <laughs>